Um, I'm Simona Nifadoy, Chief Executive of Life Lights. Thank you all very much for being here. Um, it's wonderful to have this online celebration with you all. Now, Life Lights is delighted that despite the pandemic, we've been able to get to Jersey Hospice Care to donate a brand new package of our magical technology for the children that you care for. It's thanks to the very generous donations from the Provincial Grand Lodge of Jersey that we've been able to provide the children using this hospice service with a four year package of technology and support. Now, um, the package includes maintenance of the technology and training for the Jersey hospice care staff on how to use it and get the most out of it because this technology makes the impossible possible by enabling the children there to play and to be creative and to control something for themselves and communicate for as long as possible, whatever their abilities. Everything we do is in partnership with the Children's Hospice Services across the British Isles, and we are delighted to include Jersey Hospice Care in this, thanks to our supporters. So now I'd like to hand over to uh, CEO Mike Palfreyman to say a bit about how this technology will impact the children in their care. Thank you, Simone, and we're equally delighted you've, you've chosen us for this. Um, can I say on behalf of all everyone here at Jersey Hospice Care, and particularly our children and families, uh, a huge thank you to Life Lights for the donation of this amazing equipment, and a very big thank you to Freemasons of Jersey too for making it all possible. Um, this access to this kind of equipment is a huge benefit to the children we're supporting right the way across the Children's Hospice Network, but it's also a benefit to staff as it gives staff the chance to work more closely with the children and get to understand them and their needs that much better. Uh, and the children we're supporting get a lot of joy from working with this technology. It means they can enjoy the same sort of things as their brothers and sisters, um, in spite of their often complex and debilitating conditions. We're really excited to start using this technology. In fact, I'm itching to get cracking on that uh, tilt table myself. Um, and we're very grateful also for your support for the maintenance and technical support to LifeLight. So once again, a very huge and heartfelt thank you from us, particularly on behalf of our children and families. Um, thank you on behalf of Jersey Hospice Care to LifeLights and Freemasons. A very big thank you. That's really lovely to hear that. Um, you're right, we couldn't do what we do without our supporters. And I would now like to call on um, our invite Graham Spence, who's Provincial Grand Master of Jersey, to explain why they have chosen to support Life Lights work um, for life limited and disabled children and become a platinum partner of Life Lights. Thank you, Simone. Uh, I think quite frankly, um, seeing the truly amazing Life Lights technology in use, and the life enhancing opportunities this supports not only the children, but their parents and, 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 and those around them. It, it truly touches uh, the heart. And in many ways, it epitomizes the essence of uh, Masonic charity. But supporting Life Lights in Jersey Hospice Care, it's not only about simply handing over a check. Um, to us, it, it's about enablement and an ongoing commitment, as you've mentioned, to refresh the technology um, when that becomes due and to fund the provision of the important training and maintenance, and maintenance. Ever remembering, of course, that year on year, there will be, unfortunately, more children needing this support and this equipment. You asked me why Jersey Freemasons have chosen to support Lifelines. I think my response would be to say that Lifelines chose us. And it's uh, for our members and the generosity that they they displayed. It's uh, you know you're pushing an open you're pushing an open door, and I, I think that you know we can confidently look forward to to, to many years of being um, a platinum partner in this in this joint venture with Jersey Hospice Care. That's terrific. Terrific indeed. Thank you, Graham. Um, and it's wonderful to have supporters like you who are committing their ongoing support for the Life Lights projects, um, which need um, continually refreshing. 
Now I would like to call the mic, Paul Freeman, CEO of Jersey Hospice Care, um, to accept this certificate and the uh, training vouchers that we have um, for you. Um, and you just all you need to do is call us and you can have some extra training for your staff when it's needed. Don't forget that this package also includes technical support to ensure that this equipment is kept working for these children for whom every second counts. Mike, I'd like to ask you to accept this certificate on behalf of the hospice. It's fantastic. Thank you, Simone. Um, we accept with a huge amount of gratitude and the training vouchers. That's absolutely super. Thank you again. Graham? Uh, again, I would also like to present you with this certificate to say very many thanks to you and the Freemasons of Jersey for all your ongoing support. Thank you, Simone. We're absolutely delighted to receive this uh, certificate, which will be a lasting um, recognition. We'll put it on display to our, to our members to remind them that the work of Life Lights is still going on, even when it's, it, 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 it's not in the front of our... Of, of, of our thoughts but I can assure you that it, it will be in the front of our thoughts in about four years time when uh, when Tim and the uh, and, 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 and the crew um, start to uh, think about the re refreshing this technology and moving forward again with this, this this partnership which means a lot to us thank you thank you everyone for attending today I now declare this package open for all the children to enjoy and thank you everyone for joining us in this celebration today. And if we could just have a nice round of applause, please.